Game of hide and seek is over, Dr. Reich. I have a warrant for your arrest on the charge of disobeying a court order. We have to take you with us. to talk to you about. You have to put an end to this farce. I describe Dr. Reich as mentally abnormal, but not because I believe that he represents... Well, then why? Just between the two of us. Surely you asked for my report because you believe he's innocent. Scapegoat, maybe. I don't believe Dr. Reich is innocent. I just don't think he's a criminal. I thought judges aim to make clear verdicts. What is it you want? This case stinks to high heaven. Dr. Hamilton, why do you think you find me here on the golf course and not in court? I imagine you're enjoying a well arrest, sir. Exactly. As long a rest as God wants. You see, I've been taken off the right case and retired. But that's exactly what I mean. Does it not seem strange to you that coincidences like this keep happening? No, I requested early retirement five years ago to take a look after my sick wife. Unfortunately, she died two months ago. I'm sorry. Maybe sometimes we have to accept coincidences as fate. So, Dr. Hamilton, do you have anything to add to your report? Only that I have tried to explain that Dr. Reich is not a simple lunatic, although he has acted in an irrational manner. I believe he suffers from schizophrenia and megalomania. So I think he cannot be held responsible for disobeying a court order. Hmm. I think that Dr. Hamilton has spent a great deal of time in an attempt to perform his mission conscientiously. Perhaps too long. Because it appears to me that he is no longer evaluating objectively. Now, for me, it's quite clear. There is no discrepancy between Dr. Reich's statements and his behavior. None at all. In that case, I declare this hearing closed. Dr. Wilhelm Reich will be held entirely responsible for his actions. The trial may continue without delay. But why? Listen, my job is to make an evaluation. That's all. you make life more difficult than it already is? But the prosecution is wrong. And so are you. Dr. Reich does not respect our laws. My dear colleague, we have to stop the ticking time bomb before it explodes. But what if he's on to something? Better that you forget all this hocus pocus. You watch your back. Anything else could be risky for you, too. On my worst days, I wonder what is the point of trying to heal the sick when they are damaged from the very beginning. An endless cycle that begins in childhood. This has gone on for thousands of years, through the births and deaths of civilizations. But the ocean of cosmic energy, or gone energy, follows its own course. <laughs> 